Good morning once again. Hi everybody. Welcome back to my channel. The second segment of uh, my glass painting of One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest. And uh, as I told you, uh, once the portrait is uh, complete or your painting is done on the glass, uh, you will be going over the back, uh, top over it with uh, with different size, well, I, I'm going to use different size brushes, I'll just according to what I'm doing here. But uh, what I do is, uh, this, this whole thing is going to be completely covered in white paint, so that when I turn it over, the white paint will uh, act as uh, a, a background for, for what I have here, and uh, it'll, it'll bring the painting out a lot more, a lot better. And I will show you the whole process uh, as I go along. This here is... Uh, I uh, know I said that I was going to do the signature in front of you, but uh, I wanted to do it because it it, uh, it takes a, a long procedure and a careful procedure to do this. So what I uh, what I do is uh, I take a, let's see if I can find my, my detail brush. Okay, so I got my detail brush, and then I uh, I have to go over it backwards. Okay, so I'll be working from this side. And uh, so backwards, and I should have done this over here because when I turn it over, the the uh, the signature for the painting should always be on on the on the left, on the other side. But uh, anyways, I got it here, and so uh, I have to do the lettering backwards, and I have to make sure that I that it reads properly when when that's all finished. So that's with that when that's all finished, uh, I'm still gonna paint over the whole thing white. But I'm still going to, what I was meant to say was I'm going to show you the signature anyways, and I'm going to write on, on the, onto the wood. So you can see that this is an authentic painting that I did. This, this is Jack Nicholson, Will Sampson, one of the greatest movies of all times. This is uh, One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest. And uh, I uh, did this all, well, I did Will Sam Sampson's portrait first and kind of worked my way up and around with the hand. And this, these are the juicy fruit sticks of gun, gum. Uh, I almost said gun, uh, gum, from uh, the 1970s uh, when this movie came out. And uh, so, uh, oh yeah, this is Oreo, my whole, my, my co-host. Uh, uh, so what I got to do next is uh, do the edges. So I'm going to do that in front of you right now so that uh, I don't get myself confused here while I uh, go along and jumble my words and say something totally different that I didn't mean to say. So anyways, I'm going to go over the edges where the glass is. So you can be, uh, I, I'm using a chisel brush, so that'll, uh, that'll help it a lot better with uh, keeping it uh, in a straight line kind of thing. And so you want to get as close to the edge of the glass as possible, if not uh, right at to the edge, right at the edge. That way, uh, you have all the inside to do. That would be uh, what would be the next part of this procedure. And also, once this is all completely painted white, uh, what happens after that is uh, I, I'll go over this again, about two or three coats of white so it really stands out. But uh, I'm going to show you something here too also. Okay, so this is... Uh, all the, uh, the black part, the portrait part, all the main subject, if you have different colors or whatever, you should all uh, try not to mingle them together. But anyways, uh, I waited until everything is dry for a whole day, 24 hours, before I started uh, I apply a white paint because I have to paint over it. And you don't want this stuff to uh, mix together, otherwise you'll mess your portrait up. So the uh, white paint can be painted right over the black because it's already it's already on there. It's already dried and and sealed. So I would have to scratch this off. It will come off. I just have to scratch it off. But I, uh, so you have to be careful with that too when you're doing this kind of a process. I don't want to scratch anything and because it'll uh, <clears throat> it'll create marks on your painting. So once it's all dry, it's okay to go over the whole thing with white paint like I'm doing here, and uh, it'll come out uh, with still the portrait. But this is uh, basically sealing everything right into the, with the glass. And uh, this will all be covered up in white. And I'm just going to, it's going to take uh, a little bit of time for me to uh, 
cover everything up. Starting with the edges. So I'll be doing that throughout the remainder of the day today. And I just wanted to show you the uh, how the whole process works out. So after, yeah, you gotta make sure you have your rags there and your water. Um, so this is all acrylic paint on glass and uh, I will continue the process today. And uh, once I have this all covered up, I'll be uh, flipping it over and I'll put a background on it and I'll, I'll show you the finished project and then I'll sign it so that you, uh, that'll be the third and final segment to uh, the glass painting. Uh, movie one of the movie greats greatest movies one flew over the cuckoo's nest academy award-winning movie both samson and jack nicholson and uh that'll conclude today's segment jimmy which a home you know welcome go up and go up one so uh that means uh thank you once again i'll see you again tomorrow uh, pretty much when this painting is finished. <laughs>